Well, here is something that I totally forgot I had. It's a cased 1862 pocket navy in an original Colt case. Yeah, that's original Colt, mahogany case. Actually, the, the case is in really good shape. It's solid, it's not cracked, it's not coming apart. The original felt is, is really good. Got the original directions on it. Um, case looks really good, it's a Colt case. One of the rare survivors, I guess. Any rate, I got this about, I don't know, 10, 12 years ago at a gun show. And I totally forgot about it, found it, dug it up, thought I would show you guys. This is in a, oh, let's, let's back up a little bit. You're looking at this and you're seeing the black powder cylinder, which if you can see, that stagecoach seen on there is really, really good. The cylinder's been barely used. But as you can see, there's some 22 long rifles over here. And these are CCI Stingers, about the most powerful 22 long rifle we can get, coming in at about 1,640 feet per second. This has a fitted cursed converter in it, 22 long rifle converter. Um, I bought the gun in the case just as a black powder gun and sent it off to Kirst about 10 years ago. They fitted the cylinder to it. It is absolutely smooth. They also cut a little side gate on the side of it there so that you can load it and, and shoot it and Un, and, and eject the shells without having to take uh, this part. This comes, uh, you know, it, it disassembles the same way as an 1851 Navy. This is just a smaller version. I originally was in 36 caliber. But all in all, this is a, a good little gun. I took it out to the range uh, uh, yesterday. Put about 20 black powder rounds through it and put probably 50 of those stingers through it. You know, it, it, it shot real good. I was, I was kind of surprised at the accuracy on it. Um, you know, I mean, I was ringing four inch steel at about 30 yards, so that's not too bad. Not sure what I'm gonna do with it. Just thought I would show you guys, uh, you know, this cool little case. Put about a hundred round balls in it just for looks. Got some pre-lubed wads, some cleaning pads. Yeah. Got the see, the Remington caps. Um, this looks like a Petersoli capper to me. The original cylinder. And a powder flask. It looks to be in pretty good shape. No dense dings. Looks like Petersoli uh, powder flask to me. Reproduction, of course, but uh, I've never put powder in it, so you know it looks like it's just been a display kind of thing to me. Let's see if we can get in there real quick and look at this. The directions are still written very clear. I mean, everything is still good on that case. Like I said, the case itself is is very solid. Get that powder flask out of the way. The hinges are solid. Close is good, top fits tight. It's definitely original. Like I said, don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I just wanted to show you guys this uh, cool little gun. Hey, thanks for watching my videos. Make sure you subscribe and hit like. It really helps out with the algorithms on YouTube. Not posting as much as I want to, but I'm working on getting back to it. Thanks, appreciate it.